pragmatic crab rock. Very artistic. Lorenzo's the artist, and we Garriers are like the crabs. Hard shell, sharp claws. They fight from the jungle to give birth in the ocean. We fought from the ocean and gave birth to La Revolution. See, si. I got it. Take the footpath up the mountain, very easy. A guerrilla must be sure-footed, like a goat. Goat? I thought we were like a crab. Hello? Binga. Go get him, guerrilla. A view from the waterfall was come you A view from the waterfall was so beautiful. Looks like the waterfall from El Tigre's photo. Need to get up there. Boy. El Tigre, I'm at the waterfall picture. It was taken after a bloody battle. Three days of hiding paid off when a platoon of paratroopers landed right in our kill zone. Planning and patience are Garia's best friends. So is a handful of grenades. <laughs> the waterfall around red that day. You know we saw the blood. From the soldados we killed. Yeah, I get it. This will be easy, he says. Be like a goat, he says. Binga. Looks so peaceful from up here. Goats. Fucking show offs. Disappear up here. 
make an army blind. How is the air both thick and thin at the same time? the next picture. Let me guess. Guerrillas are like sharks. They'll leave predators with knives as sharp as teeth. Actually, that rock just looked like a shark. Who's the one dangling underneath it? That's Lucky Mama. We never knew when the Sodal would find our camp, so we had to secure fast ways up and even faster ways down. Lucky always volunteered to be the first to test the lines. Arif. I hear you're brave too. Clara told me about you. You know, I also grew up without a mama or papa. And you still became a legend. <laughs> Many Garias are orphans, baby Tigre. But it's not our parents who define us. It's our actions. It's like therapy. Tigre, I'm at the statue. Last pick. Felicidades! You're at the top of the world! Now get down here! You're missing all the fun, baby tigre! My father is back in the hospital. The cancer's back. And it's spread. Shit. I'm so sorry. After what? In the cojones a thousand times. I haven't felt them since 72. Hey! Now we'll do that again. What? Mi casa su casa, baby tigre. Come on. Me the family. Lucky, my nose is broke again. I'm not your fucking mother. There are people out there who are actually hurt. I am suffering. Ay, easy, mama. Herpes doesn't count. Meet Lorenzo of Canseco, poet of the legends. Well, I sense the hot blood of a fighter. And of course, you know Lucky Mama, heart of the legends. It's not broken. Really? I felt it go crazy. Merda! Another patient? Hmm. Looks like La Morale to me. I'm Danny Rojas from Libertad. The new fist of the revolution. No, Clara sent me. Libertad needs the legends on her side. Heroes to believe it. To fight another Castillo? He's exactly what Yara deserves. Buena suerte. Sorry, one revolution was enough. Looks like Clara was wrong. A faith, Danny. They just need to get to know you. Come see me when you get settled. My baby Tigre. Okay. If we want these cranky old guerrillas to help Libertad, we need Lucky and Lorenzo on board. So here's what we're going to do. Ever since Anton got obsessed with the cancer drugs and making Viviro, finding medical supplies for Lucky's clinic has been impossible. So I bribed a pilot to fly some in. When the supplies arrive, we tell Lucky they're a gift from Libertad, and boom, everybody's friends. Perfect plan, right? 
Well, it would have been if some hijo de puta didn't shoot down my chopper. Go get those supplies before someone else does, baby tigre. Looks like they drop. What a mess. The full might of our military is sworn to protect you. This is too easy. Que vola! Who are you? We're La Moral, and the Leste is our land. Our land, our medicine. You practice that little speech? Yeah. This is property of Libertad. Ah, <laughs> Libertad. Knew you would come begging for our help. We should be fighting Castillo together. I'm Honron, second in command. Three, four. Nice throw. Name's Danny. Danny Rojas. Uh huh. Company! Over there! By the chopper! Shut her up! Thank you. 
Lady Veldal, but Yelena needs these supplies. We got wounded. Yelena's your boss? Yeah. She's gonna kick my ass if I don't come back with something. Well, Clara's gonna try to kick mine if I don't bring this to the Legends. Libertad Lee wants the Legends of 67? <laughs> half of Yara thinks they're dead. Oh, they're very alive. And half of La Moral thinks they're full of shit. But I majored in history. They paid him blood to put Anton's papa in his grave. Tell you what. You give me the supplies, I'll introduce you. Ah, coño. Yelena's gonna kill me. But at least I got to meet the legends first. Now, Danny, you get us a chopper? Then we can talk supplies. Welcome to La Moral. Liberta. Whatever. Great work. Every soldado in Yara can see you. Revolution. You gotta sign my pants. Como se llama, señorita? Honron. Eh. I'm with La Moral. Uh, La Moral? Terroristas. Honron, this is Lorraine. I know who he is. I think the word he's looking for is guerrilla. You're not guerrillas. You're a street gang. At least we're not hiding on the mountain while the world goes to shit. Have you seen what's going on down there? Go, check out a Bio Vida facility. I dare you. The legends don't take orders from anarchists. Entiende? Enough, Lorenzo. No, you know what? Fuck you. La Moral is keeping these supplies. This is our revolution, not yours. A farmer got caught in the crossfire today. Took a bullet in the stomach. Without this, he won't make it to tomorrow. Lucky mama. A lot of the bullets I pull are from La Moral. There is a difference between playing with guns and fighting La Revolution. El Tigre. Sí. They're big on lectures. If these abuelos want to live in their museum, whatever. I can't importa. Or maybe I borrow some souvenirs. Talk to me when you got a minute. 